Well, bringing it back home now, those who face the challenge of food insecurity know that health issues often make it harder to get the kind of food they need. That is particularly true for those with diabetes. This morning, Sunrise reporter Roland Rodriguez is at the Coastal Bend Food Bank, and Roland, uh, specialized food like that can even cost a little more, and, well, that creates some budget concerns. Uh, good morning, Mike, and good morning, South Texas. Uh, one of the ways the food bank is helping our community with health problems is through what they're calling the diabetic pantry. The Coastal Bend Food Bank is always looking to help those with food insecurity, and now it's helping people who are battling food challenges such as type 2 diabetes. So we have our Diabetes Hands-On Program. It's an eight-week American Diabetes Association recognized program, and um, it's for for anyone is completely free of charge. And then we have our diabetes pantry program that was actually born out of a, a grant and a study done to see if healthy foods could make a difference in those that had food insecurity and diabetes. This program that's been in place the past two years continues to see positive outcomes. Currently, we're, we're taking people with referral from, from our pantries, but also from physicians and local hospitals. And a lot of times people, when they're being discharged from the hospital, will be going home to nothing. And they have their new diabetes meds, and they're told to follow a diet, and they don't have any food. And we wanted to um, kind of solve that problem. If there is one thing a person with diabetes need in order to control their blood sugar is a stable access to food. We know that lowering the A1C by just one percentage point can make a huge difference in their complications with their eyes and their kidneys. It also makes a difference in their cardiovascular outcomes. Again, these diabetes programs are all about helping and educating the community. And knowing how to manage your diabetes is so important. It's a combination of things. It's not just food. It's not just medicine. It's not just activity. It's a combination of all these things. And, of course, we will have more information on our website later this morning at KRISTV.com. Now, let's head back to the studio, check in with Mac, and see how our morning traffic is starting to stack up. Mac?